Here's a quick review of Peace Arch RV Park in Surrey, British Columbia. We were looking for just a place to stay for one night uh, before we caught our ferry to Vancouver Island early in the morning. And uh, Greater Vancouver doesn't have a lot of RV parks and the ones that do exist aren't very nice. So we were pleasantly surprised when we found this hidden gem. It's only 20 minutes from the ferry, quick detour to get off the highway, pit stop for the night and, and move on. Uh, on arrival there was a storage area on the front with uh, the RV park entrance on the left and a really big wide entrance here with a lot of ec extra space here and separate lanes for in and out so uh, if it was ever busy or congested uh, definitely uh, would make that a lot easier pulling in and out. Tons of nice landscaping everywhere they definitely take a lot of pride in this park. Pretty large facility here, lots of sites, but I think what they do is keep uh, several pull-throughs right up front available for people like us who are just pulling in for the night. We actually didn't get in until about 8 p.m. The office was closed and they had just written our name and site number on the office door so we could just pull up and go straight to our site. Made it really easy. And uh, we were right up front in, in sites B2 and B3. Uh, so I think they do reserve those for uh, shorter term stays. A lot of the other uh, sites at the back look like they're occupied by uh, seasonal or even permanent residents, uh, but definitely wasn't uh, gungy or anything like that. Everyone looks like they take a lot of uh, care in their sites. They're growing flowers and vegetables, or they've built decks or um, outdoor spaces, and uh, it was just a just a really nice, comfortable place to stay. Uh, on the back of the office, there there were uh, restrooms and, and showers and uh, laundry. So this is site B1, uh, it was empty, but gives you a sense of how big the pull-through sites are. And we were here in uh, B2 and B3, both about uh, 70 foot long pull-through sites, 30 amp and uh, water and sewer hookups. So everything you need for a, a nice little pit stop. And it was nice being right up front. We were close to the laundry if we needed it. And uh, it was easy just to pull in there and set up quickly and, and leave the next morning. We happened to uh, unhook. Uh, we wanted to pop out for some groceries, but uh, if you wanted to stay connected for the night, uh, more than enough room to uh, keep the truck hitched up and still fit in your site. As you move down deeper into the park, it turns more into the, uh, the seasonal campers and or permanent residents. And you can see they've got, uh, people have their gardens set up and outdoor shelters, large propane tanks. It was really handy being uh, up front though, close to the washrooms and showers if you didn't want, want to use your rig and uh, close to the playground to be near the kids. So here's the back of the office and uh, the entrance into the showers and the washroom and a bit of a library there. And then just tons of gardens and green space back here. There's some tables set up. I uh, uh, don't know if you're, if you're there with a larger group, you could probably come and sit here for dinner. And uh, even uh, even larger table back in here if you had uh, several families together, you could probably use it for uh, hanging out. And this is the other back corner of the property. I think this is mostly reserved for uh, longer stay residents. You can see this one uh, set up here has a pretty big garden and that gazebo actually had a residential fridge and freezer and sofas in it. You know, that's a full setup. They've got some fake turf there, but uh, all makes it look pretty nice. There's a destination trailer. All the sites are pretty large. And uh, this is the storage facility they have for for trailers in the back corner there.
Another great feature up here by the office is the outdoor swimming pool. It was uh, already closed when we got in uh, yesterday evening, but uh, kids are pumped to jump in it first thing this morning. And uh, it's heated, it was heated to uh, a nice 84 degrees, so nice and comfortable. Rubber floors all around, so nobody's slipping. It was spotless, this was a, was a beautiful pool. Kids spent uh, most of the morning in here. Overall, we had a fantastic stay here. We'll definitely use it again uh, whenever we're uh, making a pit stop uh, to and from Vancouver Island on the ferries. Couldn't be more convenient. And if you're exploring Greater Vancouver, uh, definitely give it a shot. And uh, right behind the pool here, here's a view of the uh, playground for the kids.